Recently, Halo Infinite had a huge winter update that many players have been waiting on, finally bringing with it a beta of Forge Mode, online co-op and much more. Unfortunately, it actually broke it on Steam Deck and Linux Desktop with Proton Experimental, which is where Valve got it working initially. You will end up seeing an error box, much like I'm showing you on the screen here when you launch it, and it just won't work. Thankfully, Valve were on the case really quickly, and within a few hours, they did actually release a new Proton hotfix to get around the issue. What you need to do is make sure you unforce Proton Experimental on Halo Infinite in the Properties and Compatibility menu. Just untick the box. You can also ensure that you have Proton Hotfix installed in your Steam library, making sure it's also up to date. You could just search for a Proton Hotfix directly in your Steam library like anything else and install it, but it should be automatic once you've done it. Valve has set Proton Hotfix by default now for Halo Infinite on the Steam Deck, so just leave the compatibility menu unchecked, as eventually Valve will get the fixes needed into Proton Experimental, and then eventually the main Proton releases, where they will set it as the default, and so if you leave it unchecked now, you will get the recommended change in the Proton version automatically. You can check it detected it correctly in the Game Details tab at the bottom of the game in your Steam library, where under the Steam Play compatibility note it actually says the version of Proton currently being used, or native Linux if you're using a native Linux version if one exists for whatever game it is. On desktop Linux though, so Fedora, Ubuntu, Manjaro, Arch, whatever, you will need to manually set it to Proton Hotfix because Valve haven't actually set anything for desktop Linux on it yet. So it is a bit annoying that another game had an update and then broke, but at least Valve and their partners at the company Code Weavers, who work on Proton, were able to jump in and sort this quickly. As always, let me know if you have any trouble in the comments and if you need any proper support or chat about Steam Deck, Linux, whatever, join the Discord. The links are always in the description. See you later.